moving on to the next topic derivatives of functions in parametric form abina anartham see until now we were dealing with only two variables correct we were dealing with x and y now we are going to encounter new variables like t theta in the matter it can be anything theta or phi it can be anything so x and y it will be dependent on t for example so let me take this explain this example to you i have x is equal to t square and y is equal to t power 4 appa x is dependent on some variable t and y is dependent on some variable t correct so they are both dependent on the same variable which means there is definitely a relation between x and y so ipo in the edathla simplified case panna enna agapodu see we have t square equals x so t power 4 equals y na t square enna agum it will be square root of y i see that t square is equal to x t square is equal to root y so on comparing both i have x equals root y x square equals y when i differentiate on both sides what will i have d by dx of x square equals d by dx of y so in that la d by dx of x square is going to be 2x this i cannot further differentiate so it will become dy by dx if a dy by dx and it is 2x but what is my x from here t square so i have dy by dx equals 2 times x which is t square so your final answer should be in the in terms of t ena in therathla your given question is in terms of t correct so you should never miss your parameter so the parameter here is your t okay you understood so in the t e vechu da nama poda porom so idha vandu nama in the method la eppadi poda porom paaka porom okay so ipo first enna kuduthirukke i have x is equal to t square x is equal to t square i am going to what is the parameter here my parameter is t so i am going to differentiate everything with respect to t so d by dt of x பண்ண போறேன் which will be d by dt of t square t square t வெச்சு டிஃபரன்ஷியேட் பண்ணா என்ன ஆகும் i will have 2t so this is my dx by dt இப்போ இதே மாதிரி what do i have y equals t power 4 னு இருக்கு i am going to differentiate both sides with the parameter i have so this is d by dt of t power 4 so this is going to be 4t cube correct ah so in the edathla i have got my dy by dt now i need dy by dx which is going to be dy by dt divided by dx by dt so in the dt and dt cancel aachuna i'll be getting dy by dx correct ah idha namu panna porom what is dy by dt dy by dt is 4 t cube divided by dx by dt is 2 t what happens when i simplify 2 and 4 vandu 2 aidum t and t cube will be t square so i have 2 t square so in the edathla rendu edathilume you see that i have the same answer i have 2 t square here and 2 t square here so this particular method is very very easy to solve okay so when you need dy by dx i am finding dy by dt first then finding dx by dt okay the parameter here is in terms of t so your final answer should always be in terms of t okay clear so we'll follow this and we'll solve some example questions you'll understand it more clearly this is just an explanation so in that le ena kuduthiruka dy by dx is dy by dt divided by dx by dt okay so you are having two different functions provided the denominator is not a zero correct a denominator zero va irukka kodad because it is not defined okay let's solve an example question example 34 so what is my parameter here i see that the extra parameter which connects my x and y is theta so in that le edha vechi differentiate panna porom d by d theta panna porom we are the different the variable of differentiation is going to be theta okay so i need my dy by dx so what will be my dy by dx it is going to be dy by d theta divided by dx by d theta so idha da ipo kandupidikano we need to find out what this is so what is my x x is going to be a cos theta which is given in the question a cos theta and y is a sin theta what is my variable of differentiation d by d t d theta of x is equal to d by d theta of a cos theta in the pakkam nago d by d theta of y equals d by t theta of a sin theta so in the edathla variable of differentiation enna theta what do i have inside x so this cannot be further simplified so this is dx by d theta equals what is the variable of differentiation here theta so where a is my constant so a can be taken out of the differentiation d by dx d by d theta of cos theta is going to be minus sin theta that la variable of differentiation is theta nal theta ku thaniya d theta by dx and the marala panna venda okay so if your variable of differentiation was dx appo cos theta ku enna agum you will have cos theta or derivative is minus sin theta you need to do d theta by dx correct ah in the edathla variable of differentiation is d theta so you need not do this okay understood okay now 
So this is dx by d theta. What is my dy by d theta? This is going to be a is a constant. It comes out of the derivative. d by d theta of sine theta is going to be cos theta. So we have found out what are dy by d theta is. What are dx by d theta is. Now we will substitute So what is my dy by dx? It is dy by d theta which is a cos theta divided by dx by d theta which is a times minus sin theta. So a and the a gets cancelled. I have minus cos theta by sin theta which is minus cot theta. Okay, your final answer should be in terms of theta. So what is your final answer? dy by dx is equal to minus cot theta. Okay, clear? Please copy. Example 35. So in that the variable of differentiation is going to be t. So I need to do d by dt. Whatever your variable is, what uh, whichever variable connects your x and y is the variable of differentiation. Okay, so in that the common is t. Okay, I have x is equal to 80 square and y is equal to 280. So the common variable here is t. So a variable of differentiation should also be t. Okay, so in that the first I need to find my dy by dt. Then I need to find dx by dt. Then I need to do dy by dx which is going to be dy by dt divided by dx by dt. Correct? Huh? Okay. So first step and x is equal to a t square d by dt of x equals d by dt of a t square. In the paka if dx arka dx by dt equals that a is a constant. T, t square differentiate panna, I'll have 2 t. So this is going to be 2 a t. Ade mari y and y is 2 a t. I need to do d by dt of y equals what is the constant? 2a is a constant. d by dt of t is going to be simply 1. So, then the dy by dt is going to be 2a. Now, I need to find out what my dy by dx is which is going to be dy by dt. 2a divided by 2a t. So, the 2a and the 2a gets cancelled. So, I will be left with 1 by t. So, this is my final answer. dy by dx equals 1 divided by t. Okay, please copy. Example 36. Here the variable of differentiation is going to be theta again. In that theta dependent, so I need to do d by d theta. Okay, so what is my x? x is going to be a times theta plus sin theta. So d by d theta of x equals a is a constant. Ulla, theta or the derivative and d by d theta of theta is going to be 1. Plus sin theta over the derivative is cos theta. So this is my dx divided by d theta. Clear? Huh? Am I going too fast? Please let me know in the comment section below. Y equals a into 1 minus cos theta. So d by d theta of y equals a is a constant. Bracket cooler d by d theta of 1 which is going to be 0 minus cos theta over the derivative is minus sin theta. Theta. Correct. Cos theta or derivative is minus sin theta. Minus into minus will become a plus. So, the next step I have a times in the minus minus will have a plus. So, I will have sin theta. So, this is my dy by d theta. Now, what is going to be my dy by dx? dy by dx is dy by d theta divided by dx by d theta. So, this is going to be a sin theta divided by a into 1 plus cos theta. The a and the a is going to get cancelled. How can I write sin theta? 2 sin theta by 2 cos theta by 2. In the lama, what relation do you know? Sin 2 theta is 2 sin theta cos theta therima. So, in that instead of 2 theta, I have a theta. So, this theta will become theta by 2 and theta by 2. Clear? In the relation is going And what is going to be my denominator? How can I write 1 plus cos theta? Cos 2 theta can be relation theta. Cos 2 theta can be written as 1 minus 2 sin square theta or 2 cos square theta minus 1 or cos square theta minus sin square theta. In the multiple relations, so which one do am I going to choose? I have 2 cos square theta minus 1. So in that cos 2 theta plus 1 is going to be 2 cos square theta. But in that I only have theta. So this can be written as 1 plus cos theta is going to be 2 cos square theta divided by 2. Now, I am going to cancel. So, in that la cos theta by 2 and 1 of the cos theta by 2 will get cancelled. 2 and the 2 will get cancelled. So, what am I left with? I am left with sin theta by 2 divided by cos theta by 2 which is going to be tan theta divided by 2. So, what is my dy by dx? dy by dx is dependent on theta. So, my final answer is also going to be dependent on theta. So, this is my final answer. Okay. Trigonometric relations, you will be able to solve. Okay.
Please copy. Example 37. In your textbook, they have solved it using parametric form. They have taken theta. So, x is equal to a cos cube theta and y equals a sin cube theta and substitution. Panni. Then they have found out the answer. So, in the Mari substitution exam, la panna na, you should not be scared. You will do the normal method. In that line, no? dy by dx. No? Well, using the theta, it is given in your textbook itself. So, please refer to that. I am going to solve this in a different way, in an easier way. Exam la vandhi, enna substitution pannadhi, a cos cube theta pannadha, a sin cube theta pannadha. How will I know which substitution to make and which parametric form to use? In that line, I can also take x is equal to t square and y is equal to t square. In the mariyum pannalame abdiyan doubt uvaro. So, adhan nama enna panna poro dy by dx vay no. I am going to directly solve like how we solved in the previous exercise questions. 5.5, 5.4 lala abdi pota mo. And the mari poda poro. Okay, I am going to use the simpler method. This particular method is given in your textbook itself. I am not going to solve that. If you want, you can refer to that also. Idhi easy arndhud na. Textbook refer pannanga, illa na soli kudu kudu easy arkana, please follow this, okay? Now, I need to do dy by dx on both sides. So, x to the power 2 by 3 plus y to the power 2 by 3 equals a to the power 2 by 3. So, I need to do d by dx, correct? So, d by dx of x to the power 2 by 3 plus d by dx of y to the power 2 by 3 equals d by dx of a to the power 2 by 3. You have to understand that a is a constant and d by dx of a to the power 2 by 3 is going to be a 0. Okay. Derivative of any constant is going to be a 0. If a d by dx of x to the 2 by 3. So, what happens? The power comes down and the power will be reduced by minus 1. So, I now go 2 by 3 x to the 2 by 3 minus 1 plus in the 2 by 3 kilo varo again. Then I will have y 2 by 3 minus 1 but the variable of differentiation is going to be x. Up and go, you have to include this dy by dx. Okay equals 0. So, what happens? 2 by 3 x to the power 2 by 3 minus 1 and LCM at the 2 by 3 minus 1 2 minus 3 divided by 3. So, it is going to be minus 1 divided by 3. So, minus 1 divided by 3 plus 2 by 3 y to the power minus 1 divided by 3 dy by dx equals 0. Okay. So, in the 2 by 3 a common adiklama. So, I have or I will take dy by dx to the other side. So, I have 2 by 3 minus 1 by 3 dy by dx equals 2 by 3 x to the power minus 1 by 3. So, in that 2 by 3 and the 2 by 3 gets cancelled. So, what will I be left with? dy by dx is going to be x to the power minus 1 by 3 divided by y to the power minus 1 by 3. So, in that power and common power it is going to be minus 1 by 3. So, I can write this as x by y to the power minus 1 by 3 minus omit pannona I can write this as y divided by x to the power 1 divided by 3. Correct? x to the power minus 1 can also be written as 1 by x. Basically, I am taking the reciprocal. So, in that I have taken the reciprocal. x by y becomes y by x. So, my dy by dx is going to be y divided by x to the power 1 by 3. Okay? Please copy.